Welcome back. We all have days where we feel sluggish. Maybe it's because we're drained from our jobs, we aren't eating well or drinking enough water. Maybe it's just Monday. <laughs> Maybe you drank too much alcohol the night before. If only we could get a quick infusion of energy. So you can in the form of an IV, just kind of roll up a sleeve, pick a bag full of energy and hydration promise being offered up at Hydrate for Therapy in Edina. IV infusion services, also known as hydration stations, are very popular on both coasts. The reasons why people choose to use this IV therapy vary from jet lag to increasing athletic performance to nursing a hangover. So the first time that you, were, you tried one of these IV infusions, what did you do? I had a long night of partying. <laughs> <laughs> a fun weekend. <laughs> So you thought, okay, I, I just need just something to kind of help get me through a night of partying. Yes. And how yes. did you feel afterward? Awesome. I felt terrible that morning. Had them come out to my house, and I would say after the first hour, I felt great. Jen Lee is not here for that reason today. Most of the time, it's for the beauty bag, which isn't cheap. Some of these drips can range from $130 to $300. And I'm again, terrible at drinking water. Um, I'll spend money on it every four weeks. Anything that has to do with beauty and health, yeah. absolutely. Bryn Ahrens is the CEO of Hydrate for Therapy in Edina. The company offers intravenous hydration therapy to replenish the body to treat a variety of conditions. So I would say anybody who's dealing with cumulative effects of dehydration or anybody who's suffering from symptoms associated to any disease process, any cold, flu, any sort of you know, feeling run down, Lyme's disease, uh, there's all kinds of different things that people, autoimmune, that just, they just kind of feel that need and that extra boost is helpful. Our vitamin C and zinc and selenium and B vitamins and all these things and antioxidants and amino acids, they're all such vital things for our body. We're getting them from our food. Sydney Rowe is an athlete training for the Ironman. Um, the training regimen for that type of event is incredibly, um, it, it wears on your body in a way that it, it's hard to sustain over a long period of time. So um, coming into Hydrate IV helps me make sure that I'm replenishing all the necessary electrolytes and vitamins to make sure that I'm always performing at the highest levels throughout my training regimen. Sydney is sold on IV therapy for athletic recovery and also preparation before a race. I would come in like as much as I possibly could. I feel amazing afterwards. It's, uh, it's one of the best feelings in the world. Okay, again, this is not cheap, but Bryn Ahrens, the CEO and co-owner of Hydrate for Therapy, says that there are less expensive options. For instance, a uh, B12 shot is just $25. And I did ask uh, Dr. Richard Tholen, who is the medical director there at Hydrate for Therapy, about like the safety measures during COVID. And he says that they use the same sterile techniques as they do in an operating room. He's a surgeon, such as a scrubbing between uses uh, with antiseptic. And of course, no needles are ever used twice. And they also do a thorough health screening before your first infusion. So you have a lot of questions to answer beforehand. And, and you know, occasionally people are turned away. I was going to say, is anybody turned away? Sure. Yeah, yeah. sure. But um, in general, it's, you know, people get dehydrated. Mm -hmm. And again, it's not cheap, but I've done this three times now, uh, three different bags. And I, you know, I, I will say I felt quite hydrated and I did, I had boost of energy yeah. and there's a lot of things you can add on. They also have um, concierge services. It started out as that kind of a service where they would actually come to your house if you right. wanted. Yeah. Um, so, you know, that's of course an extra fee tacked on. Yeah. So these are all things that they're not cheap, but if you're feeling a little sluggish, you said you, you tried one in, mm -hmm. in, when you were in, in Vegas and yes. you okay, felt good. Explain to me, ladies, then how, what do you mean by you felt hydrated and with more energy? Like explain, can you explain it a little bit more? Um, well, you know, you get really dehydrated. Yeah, like when you're really dehydrated and then you drink a bunch of water and you're yeah. like, whew, I didn't realize how much I needed that. Yeah, okay, kind it's of, that simple. Kind of like that same okay. feeling. That plus, yeah. but I mean with the, you know, antioxidants and the vitamins. And, so you, you do know. feel a difference than just drinking a whole bunch of water. Right, because sometimes your body just doesn't necessarily absorb it. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and depending upon if you have some health issues, you know, autoimmune diseases, mm -hmm. it's, it's some, for some people hard to actually maintain the water. Yeah. So. How many days does it make you feel a little bit better? Or is it well, they said sometimes, it, no, it can last for several days. Okay, and sometimes cool. maybe for some people up to a week. Wow. So.
Yeah. Yeah. Check her out. I might be checking it out. <laughs> <laughs> cool.